I used to have a savings account as a kid. I had a couple bucks in it. It made no interest outside of maybe five or six cents a month or a year. I mean, it really didn't do much. I have two kids now. My kids are eight and six. But before they were born, I recognized that I wanted to set them up. Not that they, I wanted them to be rich, entitled snobs. I wanted them to have safety and security where I didn't have that growing up. And so I bought houses. I went and I invested in two houses. I, I bought more than that, but I bought two houses specifically for my kids. Simon has a house, Finley has a house. And here's what we did is I put it on a 15 year mortgage. So before they turn 18, that house is paid off. Did you know that in 20 years or so, a home traditionally doubles in value? So let's say I bought that home for $200,000. If it doubles in value in 20 years, that's now worth $400,000. And if I put that on a 15 year mortgage, that now means that my kids will have $400,000. And guess what I put down? I put down 20% on the property. So I put down $40,000 that turned into $400,000. But wait, there's more because a home is a depreciating asset according to your taxes. It, it, there's tax benefits to owning a home. So we get those tax benefits. And then I'm renting this house out to other people. I'm actually making money every month so long as the, there's not any big uh-ohs that happen. I'm making money on that house every month while I have a mortgage. Once that mortgage is paid off, and that's $2,000, $2,500 a month, in addition to the $400,000 in equity that's there. And it took one little investment, took one time of buying a house. I know not everybody has the financial means in which to do so, but you can change somebody's forever future if you choose to invest in real estate.